Athens got nuked 40 f times and has a population of absolute zero. I hosted a Rising Nations Cold War event and it was insane. This video is a summary of all the events that happened in that Cold War live stream. We had over 100 viewers. Viewers were playing in the game with us during the event. Make sure to like, subscribe, join the Discord where you stay updated on events and I stream every Friday 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Let's get straight to the video. All right, before the Cold War event started, we have a 1953 Cold War map. The USA, Soviet Union, the USA has some bases in Japan and the Philippines. The Soviet Union just has its own territory. Um, British has some African colonies, so does the French, along with the British having Yemen. And I did make sure to split Germany. So we have West and East Germany with obviously the Soviet Union holding, uh, it's kind of like East Germany, West Germany. Now, um, these are obviously all going to be Soviet satellites except Turkey and including Cuba, Communist Vietnam, and Communist North Korea. And the same being for the other side, so South, South, and West for the USA. Playing the USA, we have a YouTuber, you may know the name of Amandis, and we have William Animations, a Grandmaster, so Grandmaster versus YouTuber. This is going to be pretty interesting. Amandis, you better... I don't know what to tell you. Alright, they already got silos. All right, time for the rest of you guys to join. All right, the the link is in chat if you want to join. India, you're passive. You're not doing anything. India, wait. India, you're not doing anything but trying to fight Pakistan. Let's make that clear. If you're Cuba, you join. Okay, this is going to be a mess, but let's see how this goes. France joined Atlantic Treaty, Germany joined Atlantic Treaty, Canada joined Atlantic Treaty. Okay, that sounds good, that sounds good. Oh my gosh, Soviet already has one, two, three, four, five, six nukes. Factions were full. Factions are full, we cannot join. Factions can be full? I didn't know that. What, is it, there's a faction max? There is? There's no way there's a faction max. That's great. I didn't know that. Well, you didn't have to send money to tell me that. Shit. Thank you, though. My prediction is that with Japan right here, I think Japan can help South Korea win the North Korea War. But then there's also Soviet and China that are able to help. Hmm. Now, maybe it's just me. But I would make a lot of artillery if I'm here. If I'm South Korea, I'd make I'd make artillery and I'd improve artillery range. Artillery is going to be the way you win this war. If you want to win an attrition, at least. Now, East and West Germany. Oh my gosh, the arms race is going... Look at this. Just completing a bunch of construction of nuclear weapons. Look at US. A lot of nuclear facilities in the Midwest. So many silos. Placing silos so close together could be a mistake only because like if I strike Salt Lake City, I could take out five silos So that's why like anytime I would do silos. I always try to spread them apart. Well, you can see it here Bro, USA is giving me so much money. La 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 la. Okay. I need money So yeah, the proxies are doing what proxies do USA sending Germany a lot of money, UK a lot of money, and France a lot of money. Looks like they're building their militaries pretty well. Solid fighter force, artillery in the English Channel. You never really need artillery on the English Channel, but I guess it's always good to have it. Oh my gosh, Germany has a huge military. Let's check their military actually. Let's check Germany's units. Germany has 100 artillery, 7,000 tanks. 4 million 600, 4 million 600,000 infantry, two submarines, one destroyer, two attackers, one battleship. And East Germany has 300 artillery, 40 anti aircraft, two destroyers, 7,800 tanks, one submarine, and one unit. Wait, one submarine. Okay, well, damn. Damn. Oh my gosh. Let's check USA and Soviet. So. 
The United States has 212 destroyers, 13 nukes, and 212 submarines. The Soviets have 20 anti-aircraft. The Soviets have 19,890,000 infantry, 39 nukes. So 39 nukes and 13 nukes. USA, you either got to step it up or I don't know. That is a huge navy though. Without even battleships though. And if I was USA, I'd move the capital to like Columbus. A few moments later. Oh, it started France. Oh, the war started. Oh my god, I said don't nuke already. Wait. What the hell is this? Is that like 10 nukes in one or something? I said avoid nuclear war. Oh my gosh. And what did they do? I said avoid nukes! Soviet just did a first strike policy. Soviet instantly launched. No! Now the USA has to retaliate. What the fuck is he doing? Oh, USA striking back! Instantly, instantly striking back! Oh my gosh! The first thing they did was nuke? Are you kidding me? Oh! South Korea's winning on the parallel! <laughs> this is just chaos! USA is instantly launched! Oh my gosh, the war starts. I said avoid nuclear war, but what the hell did they think to do? Oh my gosh, I can't even tell what's being nuked. Like so many strikes are happening. Look at that. Nukes are meeting each other in the sky. The USA is still nuking. I don't know how much they're nuking, but look at this. Rome is gone. Rome is gone. Paris is gone. Uh, Madrid is gone. London's gone. Uh, uh, I don't know who USA is nuking, but it's not looking good. South Korea is dist- Whoa, ooh, China's forces are moving in. But South Korea is holding their own. They're pretty close to Pyongyang right now. They're making way more tanks. Um, the line on <laughs> South Korea- <laughs> I mean, South Vietnam and Communist Vietnam is not changing. Afghanistan took over Pakistan. And India took over East Pakistan. And, uh... And the ground troops are barely moving. And, uh... Oh my gosh! New York is getting nuked immediately. That's New York right there. Oh, I can't even... You can't even look at the event chart because there's nothing here what the manhattan has a population of two they just killed 20 million people in a single strike what the fuck who is usa nuking look at this guy look at this what what is happening what is happening it's over bro the event just started Oh, that's Moscow. The United States did not hesitate. They're double tapping Moscow with two nukes. Oh my gosh. What an absolute mess. They're just nuking anything. Oh my gosh. Like a million suns in the sky. Chicago's next. They're nuking from Salt Lake City too. St. Petersburg is gone. <laughs> they triple nuke St. Petersburg.
East Germany is taking over West Germany. Pro they nuked Moscow 10 times. I need to back up. They nuked Moscow 10 times. <laughs> what city is that? Bucharest is gone. Prague is gone. Bucharest is gone. Prague is gone. Warsaw is gone. Moscow is... <laughs> 200,000 population. St. Petersburg is gone. Miami is gone. LA is gone. Chicago is gone. Odessa? It is going for random cities. I would have got Kiev and um, Minsk at least. And the fact that they're still launching is wild. They haven't even hit Cuba yet. They might be doing that right now, actually. <laughs> oh, Shanghai went from 50 million to 1.5. Is that Wuhan? Oh no. Guangzhou? It is. Wow. Well, Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, damn. Looks like South V South <laughs> South Korea is losing. Um South Vietnam is losing. And it looks like NATO is also losing. Yeah, Soviet ruined it, to be very honest. Soviet, you could blame William Animations. He was supposed to strike first, it's supposed to be a ground war first, but... I guess forget it. No ground war, I guess. Thank you if you made it this far and watched the entire video. Thank you so much for watching the video. I'm always bad at making intros, but please make sure to like and subscribe. And... Um, I hope you have a very blessed day. Amen.